Hey, welcome back to MIA TV. Today it is freezing. I mean seriously cold. Uh, we are piking today and um, this is a quick video about clothing in this kind of weather. Air temperature is about minus two, minus three. When we got here this morning, it was minus seven. Uh, it's time's getting on a bit now. We're heading towards midday and the frost hasn't left the ground yet uh, where the sun's hitting it. Um, obviously it's beginning to melt, but anything in the shade, it is still, the air temperature is very, very cold. We're on a, a massive lake. This probably is guts of, uh, well, it's probably the guts of a couple of hundred acres. And um, it, it's not a small lake by any means, but when we got here, it was pretty much round with ice. Uh, we found one little clear spot and luckily we managed to put a couple of rods in it. So what I'm here today to talk to you about is a couple of items. I'm going to just run through them. These are the Let Me Go boots, if I can keep my balance. Let Me Go boots uh, have been around a while. Up until now, I've always worn the Ski Tex boots, which uh, were sort of seen as the go-to boot once winter came. Ski Tex were really, really expensive. And to be honest with you, a real pain to walk in. You couldn't walk too far on them. They're a real pain, as I say. And once you went on slippy ground at all, uh, it was a nightmare. They're really atrocious for holding your balance on, on ice and uh, frost. But these Let Me Go boots, uh, they're retailing at $28.95. And uh, that makes these the cheapest in the country. And these are right down to minus 30, but there's two other sets, a minus 40 and a minus 50 set. Now, as I said, we've had air temperatures this morning of about, it's minus seven when we arrived. It's probably been minus two to minus three all day so far. And my feet haven't, haven't at all got cold. And I've been standing in the water, as I said, and that's breaking up ice. Even in my ski techs, I probably would have felt something, but in these, I haven't felt a thing. I have to say, very comfy, very impressive. Now, as I said, there's two other sets in the range. They're slightly more expensive because they, as I said, are for colder climates again. But I can't see anybody wanting anything other than these. They have a lining which you can take out if you want, but if you want to leave the lining in, they're good to go. Now, the other thing I'm wearing today are these. These are the Corda thermal cargo pants. Now, in the summer, Corda released the standard cargo pants, which we were wearing. Have to say, really comfortable, loads of pockets, and in fairness to them, they're probably the trendiest looking cargo pants in the fishing world. Most of the pants that you see out there, they tend to be a little bit old man-ish, but for us younger people, having something that's a little bit more trendy is kind of cool. Because you can wear these for every day if you're knocking about, you know, they do them in two different colors, but these ones are the insulated, they've got this fleece lining in them. Now they're not cheap, they retail around the 68 euro mark, uh, but I have to say, I brought my salad pets with me and I brought, um, you know, my big coat with the sunshine on us at the moment, I don't need my coat on because I've got a number of layers. I'm also wearing underneath here the Sundridge um, undergarments, which uh, also I got from Main Irish Angling. Uh, and they are really, really great for keeping you warm when you've got you know a number of layers going on. So, uh, as I said, these, these are really comfortable. Now, what I will tell you, if you are a biggish guy, I try and go up a size because they tend to be quite tight fitting and uh, you know, so if you normally buy a 34 or a large, you might want to go to a 36 um, because as I said, they are quite tight fitting, but other than that, they're ultra comfy, loads of pockets. But most of all, as I said, I brought a bib and brace, my Sundridge Igloo suit, uh, haven't put it on, don't need it. I'm absolutely as warm as anything on my legs. Now, the back of my uh, neck here is a little bit cold. That, that's a testament to how good these trousers are. Uh, and I've got a number of layers on up here. Normally I would wear a base layer underneath my trousers, don't need them. So if you're a serious winter carper, serious uh, winter piker, get yourself a set of these. I know they are top draw, top dollar, but I don't think you'll be disappointed. They really are that warm. I've never put on anything in these conditions and felt as warm. Uh, as I said, they do two different colors. I'm gonna get Derek to come over now and show you the darker color. This is also, again, um, in the, uh, they do like this nice olivey drab and then they do the dark green. Here's Derek now in the dark greens. He's also got the Let Me Go boots on, but he's taking the liners out because he feels you don't need them. Yeah, they're, they're that good, you don't need the liner with them. I just don't know your socks on. I haven't even got heavy socks. And uh, standing in ice, ice water, not a bother on them. 
and as he said, can't agree with them more on the trousers. They're just it's like having two pairs of pajamas on underneath a heavy pair of trousers. Oh, the the bib and brace off this igloo uh, suit in the car, but again, don't need it. So. And I can't get over, uh, I have to reiterate how bloody cold it is here today. It is absolutely Baltic. This is the coldest snap we've had in, in a long, long time. To see a lake of, as I say, a couple of hundred acres frozen solid is quite a sight to behold. So, um, as I said, uh, brilliant bits of gear. Let me go boots are in stock in store. The trousers, there's limited stock. If you want them, you want to get them quick. They, they will be, there will be more coming in, obviously, but there's limited stocks of them at the moment. So, um, just say another quick thing on the trousers for anyone that you know is, wants them for practical use or wants to see the practical use of them, other than the thermal side of it. There's nine pockets in these trousers. Perfect. Everything and anything you might need, you can keep them in the trousers. And also on the side, they have a zipped pocket. So if you've got valuables, phone, keys, or anything like that, and you're out That's fishing, uh, and it's waterproofed. And they also, there's a few other specs on these. They've got special linings on them to wick away moisture. They're breathable. Uh, they have repellents on them for mosquitoes. Not that you'd get mosquitoes this time of year, but their summer trousers have that as well. Look, I have to say, you know, big fan of the trousers, both the summer, but I have to say these winter ones are superb. Get on them if you feel the cold at all. You need these. So this has been Jerry and Derek from MIA TV wishing you all the best in your coming winter sessions.